review the magic. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video from Review the Magic and another Star Wars episode. As you can see, we brought along our good friend, R2-D2. Now, R2-D2 has a few things inside here once I take his head off that we're going to open up a couple blind bags from the Disney Collector Packs Park Series Anybody going to Star Wars weekends or have uh, been there yet this year? We can't go this year, unfortunately, but it is one of our absolute favorite times of the year down at Walt Disney World at Disney's Hollywood Studios. So if we can't be there, we're going to bring a little bit of the Star Wars action to you. And that's why we brought R2-D2 along. Now, what this actually is, this actually is a popcorn bucket from the parks, which is really, really cool. So this once had popcorn in it. Now it is a really cool display piece, but also he brings us some Disney collector packs. So we're actually gonna open up two of these for you guys today. We have one from park series number 12 and one from park series number nine. And again, both of these are Star Wars. Who is excited for The Force Awakens? Yeah, it's it's still a little ways away, but I don't think I've been any more excited for a movie than I am, whoops, for The Force Awakens. So, maybe this brings a little bit more excitement to you out there, all you Star Wars fans. So without further ado, let's open up these two packs and see who we have inside. So let's do Park Series 9 first. We'll give you a quick look at who we can pull out. So these are available in the parks. They're roughly six bucks each um, per pack. And there are three figures inside. The figures, as you can see, are relatively small. Now there are 18 in each of these sets. And inside this series, we can pull out Admiral Akbar, at at Clone Trooper, Darth Vader, Death Star, DLX2 Attraction Droid, Donald as Darth Maul, I hope we get that, Goofy as Darth Vader, Greedo, Imperial Royal Guard, Jingle Fett, Jawa, Star Destroyer, Ca Star War, or Star Tours, Cast Member, Stitch as the Emperor, which is always pretty cool, Teak, Tusken Raider, and Vader's TIE Fighter, so you can get a quick little look and see the 18 different little figures that we can pull out of here. So without further ado, let's open this guy up and see who we have. And as usual, now we've done a ton of videos on these Disney collector packs, all the different series that we have. We have still have a bunch more to open up, believe it or not. Um, so if you want to check out all of our collector packs videos, I will put a link in the cards up here somewhere, that new little cards thing you can click and drop down. Also, I'll put a playlist below if you want to click on that after and go through and take a look at all the fun that we've had. So I'm going to open these over here and take them out over here. Oh, cool. Oh, are you excited? Because I am. All right, so we'll lean that up right there next to Actually, you know what? R2, put your head back on. That's my really bad. R2-D2 impression. All right, so our first one is a very classic, classic figure, ship, whatever you want to call it. It is none other than the Death Star. Take a look at that. All you Star Wars fans out there. Oh, that is just so, so ridiculously cool. Awesome. Awesome. So that is our first one. Our second one, again, is one of those super cool pieces of Star Wars history. It is none other than the Star Destroyer. Look at the detail. And again, you can see, obviously, the size of my thumb here. The figures here are fairly tiny, but they are ridiculously detailed. Look at that. That is pretty amazing how detailed they are. So that is cool. Two classic, classic figures here. We have the Death Star 
and a Star Destroyer. And our third and final from this pack, Park Series 9, is none other than... Donald? Donald? Donald is Darth Maul? <laughs> so, <laughs> this is one of the times that Disney... Uh, Disney-fies, as you would say, the Star Wars characters. Now, love it or hate it, I'm going to try to take him out here, but love it or hate it, I still think it's pretty cool. And especially if you go to Star Wars weekends, you're going to run into classic characters, but you're also going to run into Disney-fied characters as well. So get a little up-close look at Donald Donald as Darth Maul. And again, the details in these in these figures, because they're so small, are really, really, really good. And they are highly addictive, if you've been watching all our videos, <laughs> in terms of collectibles, as we have hundreds of them now. Literally, hundreds of them. Hey, if you want to see our complete collection, hit that thumbs up below from all the different series. We have hundreds of these little Disney collector packs, Park series figures. We have a couple full sets as well. We haven't completed either Star Wars sets, but I think we will soon because we have a bunch of these packs to open up. So there is Donald as Darth Maul. So that was Park Series number nine. Now let's move over to, I don't think you can see those in the shot. There you go. So let's move over to Park Series number 12 and let's open up Park Series number 12 here. And again, see who we have, and I'm going to put them over here. Our first one looks like a Seeker do Droid. I'm going to keep him in there. And again, I mean, this is pretty cool. This is actually one of the larger figures in this set. Actually, let me take them up. It's tough to see with the glare. We have definitely pulled the Seeker Droid out in the past. So if you've been watching our videos for a while, I don't think this is a new one, but we opened so many of them, I forget half the time who we've, who we've opened up and who we haven't. But I'm pretty sure we have opened up a secret droid. So you can see, he is fairly large in comparison, and he has a lot of depth to him as well. He is one creepy looking droid. Cool. So that was the secret droid. So that was our first one from Park Series number 12. Our second is none other than... Who is it? <laughs> Little trivia, comment below if you know who that is. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. If you don't know it, you don't know anything about Star Wars. So let me take... Ms. Leia out of her package here. We can show you up close. Awesome. And again, the detail in her clothing here is really highly detailed. Let's see the bottom. And again, these are really cool to collect because they display really well. They stand up really well. I know they're not Super, super large, but they definitely display really, really well. And our last one from our second blind bag from Park Series number 12 is none other than fan favorite. Now, he is a fan favorite. The actual character is a fan favorite, but he is a fan favorite. That is Stitch as Yoda. So let's open up Stitch here. And again, I believe we pulled him out before. Stitch is represented in Park Series number nine as well. And he's represented as the Emperor. So in Park Series number 12, he's represented as Yoda. Boy, they put a lot of tape on this one. Can I get that tape off? That's the question. All 
I know I can. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. All right. So let's take Yoda Stitch out. Yoda, Yoda Stitch. Stitch, did somebody say Stitch? That was a really bad Yoda Stitch impression. So that is really cool right there. I, I, I really love this. And again, character mashup. Yoda is Stitch, love it or hate it. I still think it's super cute. Love his lifesaver there. Awesome! So I want to know here. Look at his hair. Look at it. 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 Look at little Yoda Stitch's hair right there. So I want to know out of all the different figures that we pulled out today, we pulled out six of them today. Which one is your favorite? Is it Yoda Stitch? Is it? All right, it's Princess Leia. Seeker Droid. Is it Donald as Darth Maul? Because that's pretty cool too. Or is it the classic Star Destroyer or the classic Death Star? We want to know. Comment below. Even if you're not a Star Wars, Star Wars fan, comment below. Let me know which one of these you like better. So there you go, guys. That was another video from Review the Magic. Hit that subscribe button if you are not a subscriber yet. Hey, we are also starting to get a little more active on Twitter nowadays. So go over to Twitter if you are a fan of Twitter and find us, Review the Magic, over over there and start to follow us. We got some uh, different stuff we're going to throw out there, some fun stuff, not just um, Disney stuff in general, but uh, not just the the openings like, like we do here. But there you go, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you real soon. If this concludes your visit, we hope you've had a wonderful time and will return home safely.